today's movie review, I'll be reviewing the movie The White Buffalo. A movie based upon the book of the same name by Richard Sale, which features actors Charles Bronston and Kim Novak. And the movie in many ways is considered a Jaws ripoff, since it was made around the same time that Jaws was made. But is The White Buffalo really a Jaws ripoff? In terms of what the story is about, after having several nightmares about the White Buffalo, Wild Bill Hickok decides to join forces with a grieving crazy horse in order to hunt down a crazed albino buffalo before it kills any more people. In terms of what I liked about the movie, I liked the performance out of Charles Bronson playing Wild Bill Hickok, along with the actor who played Crazy Horse. I think they do their parts just fine. The movie has good set design, good costumes, good cinematography. I also love the soundtrack because it really gives off this mystical but creepy vibe to the whole movie. I also love the heavy shadows that are used during like the night shots when the white buffalo is around. And I also love the practical effects for the white buffalo itself. Like they really do manage to make a buffalo look generally creepy. I also like how this movie is a basic variation on Moby Dick. Just replace Captain Ahab with Wild Bill Hickok and replace Moby Dick with the White Buffalo. And you get the same general idea of what the story's like. In terms of what I disliked about the movie, in a movie called The White Buffalo, the White Buffalo really doesn't appear that much in the film. And the movie's only like 97 minutes long. Like, yeah, it appears at the start and the end of the movie. It's just in the middle, there seems to be a really big lack of The White Buffalo. Like, I get that... Within the context of the middle of the movie, we do have Wild Bill Hickok interacting with the townsfolk. I get a sense of what this town is like along with the people, but I feel like we could use an attack from the White Buffalo itself within the middle of the movie. Also, I never really understood the motivation as to why Wild Bill Hickok had to go after the buffalo. Because I know that he had nightmares about the White Buffalo, but why he feels the need to go after it kind of confuses me. Because... You have Crazy Horse, who goes after the White Buffalo because, well, at the start of the movie, it kills a bunch of people from his tribe along with his child, so I understand why Crazy Horse needs to go after it, but why Wild Bill Hickok, on the other hand? Not so much. Also, remember how I said at the beginning of the video that Kim Novak is in this? Yeah, she appears for like one scene, and she's just not seen or heard from since then. And some of the pacing was a bit off, because at one point, you have this guy just riding on his horse and he hears the buffalo and it causes like this avalanche but it's during like the daytime but then a couple minutes later it's nighttime and you see basically the white buffalo killing crazy horses uh tribe so the, the transition from one scene to another didn't flow as well and as far as the actual white buffalo prop goes even though the bison itself looks great when the buffalo is charging it doesn't really look all that convincing. And also, from time to time, you can see the machine pushing the bison along with the rail tracks that's on. For my final verdict of The White Buffalo, I think the movie is just alright. I could have used some more scenes with the buffalo going on a rampage or something, but as far as a Jaws knockoff goes, I don't really consider it to be a Jaws knockoff since the subject matter is about a killer white buffalo and not a killer shark. But I will definitely clump this in with essentially the other killer animal movies of the killer animal craze of the 70s. And before I give my final rating, what did everyone else have to say about the white buffalo? Looks like the white buffalo got generally negative reviews. And for my final rating of the white buffalo, I give it a 3 out of 5. So... What's your favorite killer animal movie? See you later.